Okay guys, this is a Nissan Murano 2003 with a 3.5 engine. Um, if you guys asking about that uh, ticky noise, I'm gonna show you what's the problem. First of all, there is a video posted on YouTube about the tensioners and the guides. And, uh, the guy on the video says, this guy making a problem this one right here but it's not my problem as you guys can see the guide is in a good conditions and uh, he says also to remove one of the front covers to see the tensioner if the tensioner is bad and that wasn't my problem but anyway I got a new guide for Nissan I'm gonna replace it because uh, I know this guy is making a problem. So I'm just gonna replace it. And I'll, also I'm gonna replace the chains, tensioners, everything on it. But because nothing was uh, my problem, it was in the tensioner and the guides. I'm gonna show you what the problem was going a little bit further. And I have to remove the camshaft. Get the camshaft out. Take some pliers and get the lifters out and check all of them. So, got the lifter here. And this is the problem. As you guys can see, I'm gonna try to make it you guys so you guys can see it very good. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay, you guys can see the problem there. That's the problem. I think it's because this thing is damaged it has more space between the valve and the camshaft and that's why it's the ticky noise so this is my problem so I have to replace all of them I'm gonna show you another one and this is another one this is not bad it's a little bit bad but not like the other one but still I'm gonna replace them all I got them also from Nissan because there is no any auto store they can sell them. Got them all of them here. Brand new. I gotta be looking like. Okay. Like. I don't know if you see, guys, it's clear, nice, and good conditions. This is a new one. One thing. There is a numbers. All of them has a number. 802, 806, 8010, for example. That's the size of the lifter. So if you thinking to replace the lifters on your car, you're not able to use the same ones because they are already bad. So you have to go for a new one with a different size. Like this one was uh it's a uh, 8.10 so I'm gonna go with the 8.12 because uh, they are damaged so I'm gonna show you guys once I finish the job how it's gonna look so I hope you guys gonna get some help from this okay thank you bye